Welcome to Grubbin' with Cold Moo. On today's episode, we have a product called Kadunks. This was sent to us by the company for review. Is this what all those, like, rappers are talking about? Uh... Like, like Kadunks? No, no, that's a Badunkadunks. <laughs> ah. But, oh, Badunkadunks. These look delicious enough for Drake to talk about. <laughs> they actually look like one of the weird PS motion sensor things. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Like a little Wiimote or something. <laughs> right. You might have seen uh, Dude, Where's My Challenge tried this product, actually. They have a video of it. Wait, we're not ah! the first? No. Come on. Oh, come on. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Let's try the cherry. <laughs> All right, everybody grab a kadunk. I don't <laughs> know. Bonky no. donk. Give me one that hasn't Whoa. already been kadunked. <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Let's try this out. Kadunks. Yeah, there's a cat hair on that one. Very <laughs> obvious cat hair. I saw it at the last moment. Wow, that's really fucking good. Sour candy wow. is my jam. I love me some sour candy. It's not like, you know, Warhead sour or anything, but mm. it's got a nice amount of sour to it. Um, it is a little bit kind of gritty. It's it's sort of like eating uh, honey that's like old and it starts to crystallize. It has that texture. Yeah. I think it's kind <laughs> of... Neat, I guess. It's a, it's, you know, it reminds you of Fun Dip or something. Kind of yeah. like old school. What I would probably do as a small child is mm -hmm. just get a spoon, <laughs> take out the entirety of the sour thing, and just bow them like exactly. a spoonful of peanut butter or something. The weird fruit snack thing I could do without, but like the, the goop is pretty good. Okay. Now, I would actually rather like the, uh, the like cookie or wafer. Starchy pro like the the pocky sticks or like when you get like the little dipping sticks of the Nutella. Yeah. I would actually prefer to eat that kind of like sweet uh, fortune cookie dough with that than these fruit snacks. It would be kind of jammy. I could see. Yeah, yeah I could like see a jammy see dodger. That. Yeah. <laughs> as a candy, I'm going to rate it a four, but as an overall thing, I'll give it a five. I'm giving it a four. <laughs> uh, this product is not intended <clears throat> for us, right? I mean, look at it. This is intended for kids. That's why they make those cracker packs where you dip the cracker in the cheese. No grown-ass adult eats those a lot. You watch your mouth, sir. They eat them occasionally, so you'll you'll eat this occasionally because it's kind of weird and sour if you like sour. But like as an overall, like yeah, everyday product. Like no, I'm not gonna go for this. I'm just gonna eat Skittles or something. Yeah. <laughs> But, as a pure flavor rating, I gotta give it like an 8. I would have to say, yeah, this gets really high rating. It's probably like an 8.5. I really love the flavor, probably because mm -hmm. it does remind me of those little squeeze pops. Yeah, yeah. Next <laughs> flavor. Berry Kablast. That one is Kablast, but berry. <laughs> Tropical Kabong. Oh, yeah. Wow, I thought that was cherry. I didn't really read it as sour or punch. Like, yeah. It now was just you know red. Why I said five instead of it eight. It was just red. Uh, this one's a bit more fluid. Fluid, yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Ooh, all over Cheers. your fingers. I got it. <laughs> all over your fingers. You're right. so Looks like it. you cut Spock. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go. Well, that one's a lot more, yeah, more sour, sour and tart. Holy yeah. shit. And the, um, the texture is a lot better on that one. Mm. Yeah. It's not as uh, honey chunky mm. as that other one. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's actually a delicious flavor. It kind of reminds me of like a blue raspberry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really like this one. Yeah. So I thought the other one was good just on flavor. Mm -hmm. This one's a little bit better even. I would oh yeah. The flavor of that, nine. Mm -hmm. Remember, this is candy. This is not everyday food. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Berry could last, yeah. Whatever the uh, fake berry flavor I actually like the, the gummy in this one better too. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think it has a better flavor. Yeah, for some reason. Better really flavor all around. Mm. Well, th this one was more just kind of like a a gummy bear mm -hmm. fruit chew type thing. More like, like a that juju. thing. Yeah. Yeah. Juju fruit. And this one is kind of more like a licorice almost. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Texture, yeah. Mm -hmm. We're cold moo, so we break all the rules. Oh shit, here shit. we go. Yeah, we're the coolest kids in the schoolyard. Mm-hmm. Alright, so blue and blue. We're going oh back. My God. We're going back. Watch this. Red to red. Red to red. Let's do the blue first, because it's going red. everywhere. Mm. It makes it better. Mm -hmm. I think that blue sauce is just way better. Jerry. Mm. Or punch. Mm. No rojo. Yeah, it's just sweeter in general. Yeah. And it's gritty. <laughs> so I think kids would love this shit and eat it up. Oh yeah. No question. So you rated this a nine, I'm gonna give it a, a eight. I go nine too. Not bad. <laughs> but the blue one, the blue one is the one you want to go with. That's mm -hmm. that's the winner here. Yeah. Alright, thank you to uh Kadunks for sending this out to us. Mm-hmm. And thank you guys for watching. This has been Grubbin' Cold Moon. Yeah.
Come on, Wero. Let's go get you some more goop. 